Do you know you can actually make a lot of money just by reposting already existing videos on social media? Yes, you heard me right. Whether on YouTube, Facebook, TikTok, or whatever social media platform are there, you can simply make money just by reposting videos that are already existing on that platform. Now, I know your fear. A lot of you are afraid for the fact that whenever you try doing this, you often get copyrighted. Well, that is simply because you are actually missing out on one of the most important things, which is what I'm going to share with you in today's video. And I'm going to share with you a step-by-step -step guide on how you can actually do this because I have personally done this and posted a video on my Facebook page itself that I'll be using as an example to you guys. So with this already said, and without taking much of your time, hello guys, if this is your first time on my channel, kindly do well and smash that subscribe button, like this video, and also tell me what you feel down in the comment section so that YouTube will get to recommend this video to more people that this video might also help in their hustle industry. So this already said, and without wasting your time, let's get straight. Let me actually show you a step-by-step -step guide on how you can actually make money on YouTube, Facebook, or whatever social media platform out there just by reposting videos of other people that are already on the platform. So guys, when it comes to making money, re-uploading content, there are three steps involved. The step number one is that you need to outsource the content you actually want to repost. And then the step number two is simply, you have to make a video clip of yourself actually uh, talking about a particular video you want to repost. Now don't worry, the third number, the third tip is that we have to do some little editing on the main video itself, which is the recording of yourself and then the one you outsource in order to make this 100% possible. So if you are someone who is camera shy and don't want to show your face on camera, I'm sorry, this is not the right tutorial for you. But if you are really interested in making money with this system, then I advise you to watch this video to the very end. Now, when it comes to outsourcing the content, there are a lot of social media platforms out there where you can go outsource your content. Like, you can go for platforms like Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, Twitter, or whatever social media platform are there to actually go and outsource your content. Now, I'm assuming you've already outsourced your content. Now, move on to the step number two. Now, in the step number two here, this way you need to record a clip of yourself. Now, what I mean by a clip of yourself is that you need to record a video of yourself actually making a little bit, um, maybe talking about a particular video you want to share. So, let's say, for example, the video you want to repost is a skit from Sabinus. So, instead of just um, getting that particular skit and then reposting it on your own handle, this is what you do. What you actually do is that you get a skit and then you actually make a little voiceover like, hello, guys, welcome. And today's video, I'm going to share with you one of the most funniest skits ever. So, after that uh, particular line then you start playing the skit itself don't worry i'll show you how you can do it in the video editor now i'm hoping you already get idea of what we are coming to do and then you've gotten your you've gotten your first step right which is outsourcing the content and then you've also gotten a recorded version of yourself now we'll move on to the third point which is where we actually get to do the editing which is the main work itself now when it comes to doing the editing a lot of you often ask if you can only do this on your laptop or this or that now, the truth is that you can do it with any gadget at all. All you simply need is CapCut Video Editor. So CapCut Video Editor is 100% free for anyone at all to use, whether on your iOS, Android, or even on your desktop computer, it's 100% free. So I'm assuming you already have every single thing ready and ready for the third step, which is the final step in this tutorial. So let's get straight on my laptop because I'll be doing it on the laptop to make it easy for you to get a better view of the whole process. So let's get straight on my computer for the final step so now we are inside CapCut, and when you come inside CapCut, all you simply have to do is simply click on create new project now you can do this on CapCut mobile device or you can do it on CapCut on your laptop it doesn't really matter so you simply have to go on CapCut on regardless of the device you are using because it's CapCut that we are going to do the editing so once you click on it now the first thing you need to do is that you need to import in your video clips so i'm just going to get this in and i'll come back here and then Get a video clip of myself. I think I should have this one here. Okay, no, this is not a video of myself. Let me just come over to my videos. Now, I'll just grab this particular video right here. And then now what you simply have to do is that you simply have to, first of all, drag your main video over here. Now, why you are putting your main video as a background is that your main video will be the background and then the video you are coming to show to the main people itself will be just a snippet in the middle of your screen. Now, the reason why you're putting it in the middle of your screen whilst you are being shown on the background at the same time is that it lets social media see that what you are just showing people something and you are not actually re-uploading the actual video itself. Now, this is a simple secret when it comes to using people's content that a lot of you don't know yet. Now, after this, I'll simply drag this video, which is the one I downloaded, 
I'll keep it immediately after the intro ends. Remember, I told you something that you are going to do an intro. The intro, if it's about skits, you simply tell them that in today's video, I'm going to share with them one of the most funniest skits that will actually make their day. After that point, then you bring in your video in here. Now, some of you will ask, if that is the only intro I have to do, then how am I going to get a long video that will also meet up with the length of the skit to actually keep the skit in the middle? Now, what will actually give you that length is that after you record it like that, you simply have to du duplicate that particular script, I mean, that particular scene of you actually um, recording the intro. Like, for example, let me say the intro I did is long to this extent here. Now, what I'm simply going to do is I'm simply going to drag this one and then double it. I'm simply going to double it up on the scene like this. I'm just going to keep doubling it. And then. I'll just copy it. Repaste it again. I'll just drag this to add it up. Now this is simply how you have to just copy and then replace them until you get to the actual video length. Until you get the actual length of the main video that you are coming to show to them. Now after this, you simply have to mute the audio of your mini clips. You only keep the audio of the first one that you recorded yourself, which is the first part whereby you were introducing the video to them. You simply have to keep the audio. The rest part have to stay muted. Now after this, you see you have their video in the middle like this. And then just minimize it so that it doesn't fit in the full screen. And then you can also keep it on the side if your video is recorded in a landscape like this. Or if your video is portrait, you simply have to keep it in the middle. Just make sure that what your face is still showing. Now after this, you can see that the first part of the video will be the intro. The intro is, is just about you and nothing else. Let me drag it to the intro. Now the intro is just about you. Now after the intro, now the video starts playing. Now where the video is playing, you don't, have oh to be God, saying, you don't have to be saying anything. You simply have to stay in the background like that just to make sure that what it doesn't look like you are just reposting the actual video itself. And these are the rules. Number one, you find a video you want to react to, use movie clips or anything. You, secondly, you record yourself. Make sure that you record yourself a bit lengthy to make the duplicating work easier for you. Secondly, you add yourself to the background and then you simply add the video that you want to show to the people as an overlay on your main video. And after this, you simply have to hit on the export button here and then export your video and you are good to go. With this, you are actually going to get monetized on every single social media platform out there, provided that you follow every single rule that I shared here with you. So with this already said, hope you find this video helpful. Don't forget to smash that subscribe button, like this video and tell me what if you done in the comment section. So have a lovely day. Bye.